Hi guys, it's Todd Jarrett here from NRG TV and mcnews.com.au bringing you all a wrap up from round nine of the 2016 Modal MX Nationals here at Echo Valley in Toowoomba, Queensland. In the Pirelli MX D class, all eyes were on the Yamalu Yamaha Racing Team rider of Mitchell Evans. He staked his claim in the field, taking his sixth consecutive race win, going 1-1 on the day, extending his championship points lead over the number seven of Connor Tierney. In the Modal MX2 class, it was Nathan Crawford who extended his championship points lead over the DPH Motorsports Yamaha rider of Jed Beaton, now opening his gap up to 10 plus points from Beaton and Caleb Ward. That is Nathan Crawford. In the Thor MX1 class, it was another story of craziness. We added in the National Pump Monster Energy Kawasaki import of Kyle Peters, the 110. He took the GoPro Super Pole win this morning. He took a race win in moto number one, but wasn't able to overcome Dean Ferris and Kirk Gibbs in moto number two. For Kirk Gibbs, he lost only a couple of points to Dean Ferris, the CDA Yamaha rider, in the overall scheme of things for the championship. And he will head in with a small gap from both Dean Ferris and Todd Waters heading into Coolum next weekend. If you're anywhere in Australia and you're thinking about heading to Coolum next weekend for the final round of the 2016 Modal MX Nationals, I dare say it's a good idea because the racing has been crazy and it's going to continue on in that fashion next weekend. If this weekend is anything to go by, next weekend is going to be even better when the titles are on the line. If you can't get to the track, make sure you tune in to www.nrgtv.com.au for all of the live action in high definition HD. This is Todd Jarrett from NRG TV and mcnews.com.au signing off.